These are my top six things to do in Nashville, Tennessee. All right, Wanderers, we're starting off the night late in Nashville. We came in, did a little road trip from Chicago. So where should you come if you're coming in late? Or if you're at night walking around anyways? You gotta check out the John Sigenthaler Bridge. I read it once before doing this take, so give me some slack. The, the view of the bridge is just beautiful. I mean, who doesn't love that nice pinky red? You get the reflection illuminating on the river. Absolutely gorgeous. And the moon was particularly beautiful tonight. I'm an astronomer, so I love that shit. And we also got to see nice views of the downtown on the other side of the bridge. So it's a nice pedestrian walking bridge. It's nice and calm, nice and easy going. And it's a great way to get your bearings straight, get a nice view of your surroundings, and then get a little bit of nature and a little bit of city. So you gotta check out the bridge, guys. Bring your cameras, bring your girl, get down on one knee, ask her the question. Are you a wanderer yet? Let's hit it. <laughs> Get out of the shot. No! <laughs> Stop! <laughs> <laughs> so we just rolled into Nashville and uh, we're a pretty big deal. We're performing tonight at the Country Music Hall of Fame. Uh -huh, okay, Tom. What are your impressions of Nashville so far? A little, little be nasty? I like it. She like you. We just checked out Noble Park. We're walking around the Gulch. Just checking some things out. We're looking for murals. They look pretty cool so far. Are you having fun, B? You have to say hi to the fans. Now, number two on my list is to visit the Happen neighborhood, 12 South in Nashville. Now, my favorite thing I did here was hunt for murals. A little bit more peaceful than hunting for some little critters in the forest. These murals are beautiful, they're artistic, they are plentiful. They are all over Nashville in general. Now, this neighborhood also has many stores, great places to sit outside and eat, lots of cute boutique shops, so it is a great place to spend the afternoon. Another mural. Vanessa! I'm all right. Did I get in your way? All right, Wanderers, you'll never guess what just happened. So we were just walking around and we stumbled upon this crazy wall. I didn't even know it existed. Now, Vanessa wanted to go here really badly. I'm getting some major Rolling Stone vibes. She's gonna do a little modeling shoot. Her agency has been uh, asking her to send some pics back of our sponsored trips. <laughs> Shamelessly, we've been here for like the last 30 minutes trying to get the perfect couple's picture. I'll clip it in so you guys can see how unphotogenic we are. Old guy just staring at us for the last half an hour. Can you see him? Can you see him? Please smash the like button. Don't, yeah. don't. I see him. I see him. We're gonna keep on walking around this area. This is around 21st Street. We took a little detour from 12th Avenue South, and we're just checking out the murals some more, guys. Hillsboro Village also has some amazing food options, as I'm showing you on screen. The video above will show you all of the things I ate in Nashville. One of the truly unique things to do in Nashville is to visit the Parthenon. Now you don't have to hop on a plane and find an expensive flight to Greece, although it's more authentic. This is a replica of the Parthenon if it were to be completely unscathed. The pillars, the ceiling, all of the intricate detail in the sculptures, the sheer size of this massive structure is truly breathtaking. Does the music fit the landscape, Vanessa? Does the music fit? Yeah. Yeah. 
No trip to Nashville would be complete without visiting Music Row. This is the hustling, bustling downtown you've most likely seen. If you still have the energy for it, go and get some drinks, go out with your friends, meet some strangers, see live music, walk around from place to place, and really be enveloped in that typical thought that is honky tonk Nashville. So those are my top things to do in Nashville, guys. I hope you liked the video. Nashville has a little bit of something for everybody, whether you like drinking, eating, nature, art, the options really are there. So please leave the video a like if you liked the video. Hit subscribe if you wanna see more travel content or Tennessee content in the future. And I will see you guys soon in the next video. Peace.